He just very nonchalantly detached the legs and the squirrel tin. Hello scientists, welcome to Chabal Matt, the scientific illustration channel for scientists. And uh, I want to share with you that I bought the anatomy book. This is Frank Netter's A Human Atlas of Anatomy. This is more popular in the U United States. The anatomy book I used while I was studying was Thyme, uh, or they call it Prometheus here in Europe. My book is literally new, uh, that you can still see the plastic wrap. Let's unpack it together. Um, let me see how I will just rip it off. Oh, I can't smell anything uh, now because uh, I just had COVID a few weeks ago. You get to see that the color is very vibrant. That's one of the main feature uh, of uh, Netter's work. So who is this uh, medical illustrator Frank Netter? He was a medical doctor from the New York City and a very interesting background of his was that he first went to the art school. That's a very unconventional trajectory that you went to art school first and you uh, apply for medical school and got in. While he was a medical student, his sketches caught the attention of the medical faculty. So then they started to uh, ask him to uh, make illustrations. That's what they do to students that when they see there's something useful, then they ask you to do work for them. But after he become a practicing surgeon for a while, then uh, he decided to drop his medical practice and then become a full-time medical illustrator. If you look at his uh, muscle fiber, he just indicates the overall shape of the muscle fiber instead of make it a really refined. If you enjoyed this video, please give a thumbs up. Subscribe to Jobomet for more of the scientific illustration content. One of the reason that uh, my program, uh, they didn't prefer Netter as the study material was that their style here in Europe is more like very uh, sharp and detailed. I can show you uh, the one that's on my door. If you compare these two, then you'll see that there's a big difference in how uh, refined the muscle fibers are. It uh, gives a very serious and uh, an elegant overall style to the illustration. You see that they did like a very uh, surgical clean cut over there. As for Netter, you see that he just very nonchalantly detached the legs and the squirrel tin. Just went on Line to some medical student forum to check out which anatomy book they think is the best and then it turns out that it was uh, Netter. Yeah, let me know in the comments uh, which anatomy atlas you use while you're studying. Uh, do you use Netter or do you use uh, Thyme? Netter was so much cheaper than Thyme. It was like 77 euro 50 cents and Thyme was 141 and 99 cents. Another thing I found out was that Netter has a coloring book version. I guess that they think this is a good way for uh, people to memorize the anatomy structure, that if they have color it. Uh, yeah, let me know if you have used a color book, uh, that if it helps you, uh, I think it's quite fun. And if you want me to review the color book, also let me know in the comments. You can find the Amazon link of them in the description below. Thank you for unpacking this book with me. I look forward to seeing you in the future videos. Funny thing about the loss of smell of my COVID is that I cannot smell the bad smells. Like, uh, I cannot smell pee, I cannot smell poo 